take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Stitches, or sutures, join the edges of a wound together to repair it and stop any bleeding. However, they can sometimes become infected. Some symptoms of infected stitches are worsening pain, redness, swelling, and pus around the wound. Take our lead. Ah, airing out most wounds isn't beneficial because wounds need moisture to heal. Leaving a wound uncovered may dry out new surface cells, which can increase pain or slow the healing process. Most wound treatments or coverings promote a moist, but not overly wet, wound surface. Take our lead. What happens if you leave stitches, or staples, in too long? Get your stitches out at the right time. Stitches that are left in too long can leave skin marks and sometimes cause scarring. Delays also make it harder to take the stitches out. Make your mark, take our lead. If the stitches are left in the skin for longer than is needed, they are more likely to leave a permanent scar. Non-absorbable sutures also are ideal for internal wounds that need to heal for a prolonged time. Take our lead. Keep the wound bandaged and dry for the first day. After the first day, wash around the wound with clean water two times a day. Don't use hydrogen peroxide or alcohol, which can slow healing. You may cover the wound with a thin layer of petroleum jelly, such as Vaseline, and a non-stick bandage. Take our lead. If you have absorbable sutures, do not clean your incision with hydrogen peroxide. Peroxide is too harsh for most incisions and can cause irritation, which can lead to infection if you use it near your surgical site. Instead, use water and a mild soap to gently clean your incision or your stitches. Make your mark! Take our lead. There is generally no need to remove dissolvable stitches as they will eventually disappear on their own. If a person does need to remove their stitches, they should follow their doctor's instructions carefully to reduce the risk of infection and other complications. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. For the stitches that you can see, make sure to watch for any signs of infection. These signs include if the incision area is red, swollen, or weeping pus, or if you have a fever, vaginal bleeding and discharge. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.